Hey guys, it's uh, Don here. You know, uh, I just thought I'd do a quick uh, like review on this uh, Ego electronic cigarette. And I'm sorry about my voice right now. I have uh, a slight cold and my throat's all fucked up. But I'm gonna try to get this done for you guys. Now, I just want to like talk about these uh, e-cigarettes a little bit. I used to smoke uh, a pack and a half a day, sometimes two packs if I was drinking, but. I was smoking for about seven years, and after smoking that much, I'd wake up, I couldn't stop coughing, my, my throat would be just destroyed and wrecked. So I, I want to get back into shape, start doing uh, weightlifting, and get my body back into shape, just healthy. So I decided to try these out, these uh, e-cigarettes, and I'll show you the ones I have here right now. I have a few disposable ones here. I had the blue uh, rechargeable ones, but... Uh, when I got my ego, I uh, gave uh, my blue pack to somebody else, one of my friends. I just didn't really need it anymore once so I got the ego. I just prefer the ego a lot more. But let me show you these real quick. Now, when I first started, uh, I first used one of these blues, one of the blue disposable ones. Uh, they came in, uh, I believe, menthol and regular. They're really good. Uh, they're just really expensive. I, I couldn't justify paying like eight or nine bucks for something that lasts me half a day. I bought it like three or four times. It's three right here. And then I have one of these, like no name brands. It's uh, Tes Tesimi. Tesimi. It's some weird name. This was a uh, blueberry flavored. This one was only like four bucks, so I picked it up. And actually, uh, when I first got it, it was completely dead. Uh, the vaporizer or the uh, heating element was just gone. So I, I brought it back, and they just gave me a new one. But it was all right. It had a nice blueberry taste, and it was good. Then I saw these uh, Enjoy Kings, and... I heard a lot of good things about them. People were saying that it tastes like a cigarette, feels like a cigarette. Well, it's the exact same size as a cigarette. It's uh, the same thickness. It has a papery texture. So it kind of feels like you're holding a cigarette in hand. It's really lightweight. It's, I believe, like one and a half times the weight of an actual cigarette. So when it comes to like holding it in your mouth, you can like hold it in your mouth and just like work to what if you need to do like a real cigarette it doesn't uh weigh down your mouth like it, it just feels like a cigarette so i really like these but these ones uh down at the gas station they're uh eight dollars for one and once again it'll last me like half a day smoking on this it's just a small battery uh not that much liquid inside and the problem i had wasn't really liquid it was always the battery dying but if you're just getting into vaping, if you uh, want to try something out to see if you like it, I definitely recommend these, the Enjoy Kings, because they give you a nice throat hit. Uh, it gives you an experience, uh, like an idea of what vaping is all about. And it's a really good way to lean yourself off of cigarettes. But I would not recommend you buy these like every day because they are expensive and it's just not worth it for the price. Now when it comes down to uh, something you want to buy and like use daily, I'd suggest investing into one of these Egos. This one I believe was uh, 40 bucks, 50 bucks, over at the uh, Tobacco Leaf store. They just uh, sell cigarettes, cigars, uh, Egos, electronic cigarettes, everything you can think of they have over there. So for 60 bucks, and uh, what was 10 for the liquid, and 50 for this so uh, 60 bucks you can't go wrong the liquid lasts like three weeks because it's a pretty big container but uh... this is uh... this is the one it came with the uh... little clearmizer little uh... liquid tank i'm not a big fan of this one because i don't know if you can see it on cam but that little thing inside is like bent. I don't know if it's because it melted when I was using it or whatnot, but because it bent like that, 
liquid gets inside of the mouthpiece and uh, it's not supposed to. You, you taste the uh, liquid getting in your mouth, it tastes disgusting. You don't want the liquid in your mouth, you just want the vape in your mouth. But my friend gave me this one right here. Well, I paid five bucks for it. And this one is quite large. It holds like three milliliters of e-juice. So uh, I poured the e-juice in here and it just doesn't really work that great. It just doesn't uh, it doesn't heat up. I think that the uh, vaporizer piece is uh, burnt out or burning out because it gives me very little uh, vape. And I have to draw on it for like 10 seconds to get any kind of vape out of it. So I still have it. I'm going to see if I can get a, find out how to replace it, get it fixed because I do like the style of it. It's a nice large tank. If you fill this tank up, it's going to last you a good two days because that's three milliliters. I, I smoke maybe uh, 1.5 a day, so it will last you a good two or three days. But this is the one he uh, gave me because that one didn't work. Let me unscrew it real quick. <coughs> and I really like this one a lot. It's I don't know what you'd call it. If uh, you consider it a clarimizer or just uh, I'm not sure, but I know this is a clarimizer because it's like completely transparent, has the wicks going down it. This one doesn't have any wicks; it's all gravity fed. Uh, you unscrew the bottom to fill it up. That one you just take off the uh, the top piece. But the reason I like this one so much is because it's sleek and the material is the same material as the uh, stuff on the battery, the coating. It's like a really soft touch plastic, kind of like what you'd see on cell phones, that same uh, soft touch plastic-y feeling. It's nice, it feels durable, good build quality. <coughs> and like I said, I'm sorry, but I am sick. Uh, I felt like shit the last two days. But let me put this back on and I'll vape for you. Show you how much uh, vapor it produces. It's really nice. I like these a lot now. This is the first uh, Eagle style vaporizer I've had, and I'm enjoying it. You can see it uh, produces a really solid amount of uh, vapor. It tastes great because uh, right now I took uh, some blueberry and my uh, melon one and mixed it together, so it tastes like. Uh, Kind of like a fruit roll-up. It's really sweet, smooth, fruity. But it's, if you're trying to get off cigarettes, I definitely recommend you try and start out on one of these Enjoy Kings. Buy one, maybe two, and see if you uh, like the feel of the vapor. If uh, it's something you can do. I wouldn't recommend you go out and buy one of these instantly because it is pretty expensive. And if you find out that you don't like vaping, if you don't like the taste, and you just wasted like 50 bucks. So I'd say go out, spend like 8 bucks on one of these disposable ones, puff on it throughout the day. If you like it, then definitely skip the blue packs and go for one of these. They're really simple to use. You can put your own uh, flavors inside. And yeah. I just really prefer these over the blue electronic packs. Well, that's my review. Uh, I came with this nice little leather or pleather carrying case where you can fit like uh, you can fit two uh, egos in there plus like some juice, maybe even an extra battery if you had one. I want to definitely buy an extra battery and just keep it charged up because when my uh, battery dies or when I run out of juice, you know, I do have a cigarette because there's nothing else I can smoke. But like I said, going from a pack and a half of cigarettes a day down to two or three, it's all because of this. This, this helps a lot. So if you're trying to get off, start with a disposable if you like it. Upgrade to one of these. Try out different juices. Uh, look online. There's a lot of people online that uh, can give you websites to get like really good flavors. 
some of the flavors you get, like gas stations, would taste uh, old, kind of rusty, and just nasty. So you definitely want to get good flavors. But what do you guys think? Do you uh, do you guys like vaping? Are you trying to stop smoking and get into vaping? Uh, leave comments and just let me know. Peace.